we're making some progress, so stick around. Okay, so I'm just doing a voiceover here because I wasn't pleased with the wording, but basically if you look along the top there, that has some loose batting put inside, <clears throat> and then the tape is to seal it off and keep it in there. Um, as you can see, we've made some progress. We've got uh, insulation about 95% done. Basically everything needs to be taped up uh, finally, and it's just about ready for the walls as soon as I get the wiring figured out. Um, if you look up there, there's some spots where I had to just kind of stuff some random pieces in, um, but I think that'll be just fine. Again, once the ceiling is in and the walls are in, you won't see any of this stuff, so it should be fine. Um, the doors proved to be quite the challenge to get everything in there nice and neat while still uh, insulating and, and not causing problems with the mechanism, but we were able to get it done. Um, this is our first time doing this, so uh, slowly but surely, it is coming along. Okay, so after a lot of deliberation and a lot of looking around, I decided on a seat for my daughter in the back, for Sydney, and what I came up with was this. It's pretty cool. It needs to be set up on a pedestal, which I'll build that so that it matches the other seats uh, height-wise. Um, and then eventually someday we'll probably get it recovered, but for now it's gray Theme in the van is black and gray, so it should be okay um, But uh, Yeah, it fits pretty nice It's only uh, 16 I believe inches wide or at the base at the widest point So it's it's fine for a young girl, you know, actually I can sit in it. I'm 200 pounds almost 200 pounds and six foot tall So I can sit in it. It's not bad you know, I could ride in there for an hour or two. It's not that bad. Um, it's got it's pretty cool because it's got a cup holder in the bottom. <sighs> See, it's got a whole little storage compartment. That cup holder flips out, um, and when you f and the whole seat folds down as well. Uh, what this is is an F one fifty center console. I'm sorry, F two fifty center console seat um, um, from the. I think it's called a. 40 40 20 something like that I believe or 40 20 40 something like that um, but the neat thing about it is, is the seat belts are integral to the seat so I don't have to worry about you know crash testing stuff I know the seat belts gonna work I know it's safe all I've got to do is make a base for that that's nice and strong and and she's good to go and nice and safe so um, there's gonna be a cabinet of some sort here anyway so she'll ha she'll be kinda you know encased in there uh, I might even put a little pad on this side just in case, um, so she doesn't whack her head on something in case of a rear end. Um, but yeah, it's uh, it's pretty good. I like it. Um, it's a pretty pretty good looking little seat. It's quality, and I got it for uh, let's see what was it on eBay. I think with shipping it was around two and a quarter. So not much more, if any, than the little cheap fold-down seats that they make for the sprinters and that's a heck of a lot nicer seat and a lot more comfortable um, so yeah so that's it um, we're making progress we're getting there <laughs>